What's up, y'all? B Dub, the Anime Master, is back for another anime video. Today, Bleach, Thousand Year Blood War, Episode 3 review. Intro start. B Dub, the Anime Master. 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 Dragon Ball Z, the Anime One Master. Here we go, the Anime Death Master. Death Master. Nigga. Dragon Ball Z, the Anime One Master. Piece. So, where do I begin? Uh, there is... Here's the thing. Like, I enjoyed the episode. The episode was great. It was fantastic. Still great music, animation, voice acting. It was awesome. But there are some alarming things going on with this Bleach adaptation. And a lot of the anime community or the Bleach community has been pretty vocal about how the Thousand Year Blood War is being rushed. And I half agree to their, you know, arguments about this. Now, in the first episode of the Thousand Year Blood War, they blew through five chapters, you know, to try to reintroduce the characters, introduce the setting, and etc., which is absolutely perfectly fine. Second episode didn't do too much damage, but this episode here blew through six fucking chapters in one episode and then there was a lot of cut manga content now now you may be sitting there wondering okay the cut manga content is not important well some of it really was and one of the main cut manga components was there was dialogue between the lieutenants and kira had some more dialogue so when kira gets you know annihilated you actually feel more weight to see that happen on screen and the adaptation, the Thousand Year Blood War episode, Kira just gets one shot at it and that's it. Because the manga scene where they were talking is just completely cut. Now, I don't understand this current direction where they cut out important manga scenes and then they have added scenes, expanded scenes on top of the stuff that was cut. It just doesn't make any sense. Now, I know this series is supposedly supposed to be 52 episodes long. It's going to be four cores four seasons and it's going to be 13 episode seasons i believe either either 12 or 13 episodes so i know they have to get through 200 chapters worth of material in a short amount of time i feel like they should have green lit the series to be about 65 episodes maybe 70 then they would have had more time but maybe there was some you know budget constraints i don't i don't fucking know who knows now i'm not going to be in the cause of alarm that each episode is going to be six chapters six chapters six chapters that'll be a total fucking mess i do assume that it's going to slow down the pace just a little bit and then ramp it up some more i feel like they are blowing through a lot of the beginning part of the thousand year blood war first invasion so they can get to the second half of the invasion and really expand upon those battles you know it has like this full metal alchemist brotherhood feel where when they were redoing the anime, they blew through the first arc in 13 episodes, which was insane. And it's and it a bit messy, but it fits okay. I feel like they're doing the same thing here with Bleach. They want to get through some of the beginning segments first, add some expanded scenes, and really get to the, the really meat of the arc later on and really expand some of these missing fights and battles where characters just disappeared for no reason. I would say that I am concerned, but at the same time, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait and see. We are only three episodes in. I understand the controversy and some fans being angry about this, but guys, we have to just wait and see. Now, if the first core is a complete mess, where they just blew through so much material in the first 12, 13 episodes, then we can have this talk. But I wanna just wait and see and see whether or not things are gonna either speed up bad or slow down and be more of a good pace, you know. We'll just have to just wait and see. Overall, the episode was great. It was fun. Ichigo fighting against, you know, the Nazi Quincy. I don't know how to pronounce his fucking name. Quig Quigley, Quagley, whatever the fuck his name is. Uh, Quagmire. No, I'm just joking. But that whole battle was great. Um, great animation with all of that. Um, the Iran car uh, um, trio and the monster battle was pretty good. Um, the only weird thing about that was that it felt like Ichigo was on the sidelines while they were having their fight. It was a little weird, and it just came out of nowhere. I gotta reread that chapter and see was it exactly like that. But one thing I do want to mention, though, is that most manga to anime adaptations are not one-to-one -one ratio. 
Sometimes scenes are removed, scenes are rearranged, and scenes are just changed. It happens. You know, I, I really don't know any manga that's just 100% perfect one-to-one -one ratio. None of them are. So I'm not going to be too negative about this. I want to do the wait and see approach. I'm a little nervous, but I'm going to be, I'm going to just wait and see. But overall, it was a good episode. I just hope things get a little better as far as the production. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I am B-Dub, the Anime Master. Stay tuned for more anime, manga, and video game related videos. Peace. Follow me on social media, please. Follow me, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok pages. Links are in the description. Subscribe to the YouTube channel, and don't forget, hit that bell notification. Hit the bell notification so you'll be updated on brand new B-Dub the Anime Master videos.